Yo, here guys and here, here we go, my One Piece live reaction to One Piece Mega Chapter 976. My computer is whirling away in the background, my PlayStation is doing an upload, but I just want to get straight into this chapter. Starts off with a beautiful cover page image of Request, Tontatas helping the Straw Hat crew make shoes. And we see all of the Tontatas there, we see Leo, and we see not all of the Straw Hats. We don't see all of the Straw Hats. We don't see Brooke, we don't see Frankie, we don't see Robin, the disrespects. We've got Nami there, but no Robin that I can see, and no Jimby, um, of course. Jimby's always left out. Unfortunately, I accidentally saw a spoiler on Twitter, so I kind of know what's going on in this chapter. And then I went on YouTube and I saw all the thumbnails, which is really annoying. So let's get into what this chapter is called. It's called Chapter 976, Begging Your Pardon. <laughs> and it starts off, we've got all of the nine red scabbards, the remaining ones, not including Denjiro. And uh, Neko Mushi is not here. Punching, punching Kinemon. It's weird that we've got, uh, we've got like the one piece, just a blank page on the other side. It's uh, quite weird to see that. Just be honest with us, Kinemon is thinking in a rushy. Obviously, Kinemon is still maybe trying to be boastful of the fact that he... Pretending that he came up with that plan inside Karamatsu's head. All's well that ends well. We won't be mad, so fess up. Uh, we got Okiku looking shocked. Uh, stop it. Stop right now. And then we got Raizo thinking in his head. Admit it. Admit you thought it was Takage Paul. <laughs> so they're calling him out. Kinemon. Perhaps I will die in the battle ahead. Wait, what? It feels as though I've just used up the... An entire lifetime's worth of luck. What are you saying, Kinemon? Don't you die. Don't you die on me, Kinemon. Don't you die on me. I got that cosplay. I want to be wearing it for years. Don't you die on me. I want you in future arcs. He's not kidding about being lucky, someone's thinking. I think I think maybe that's Senjiro thinking it. Sir Kinemon. That's our leader. If anything... You've been channeling our good luck for having you as a comrade in arms. So, who's saying that? So, Kinemon, that's our leader. If anything, you've been channeling our good luck for having you as com as a com comrade in arms. Who's saying that? That's nice. Then we've got Okiku. They're right, Master Kin. We won't let you die alone in Urashi. We serve Lord Odin together. Ashura Doji. We might have been born and raised apart. But we'll die together. Come on, guys. Don't talk like this. Kinemon smiling. It's cold comfort coming from a band of stinking men. Raise your katana, Kin, says Denjiro. We've won the opening battle. And then Kinemon says, uh, Then I accept this fate. Ooh, Kinemon. He's got his sword up in the air. One of his swords up in the air. And we see Denjiro there on his ship. Everybody else has got their swords up. That's a beautiful panel. All of the ships, all of the ocean. Apologise if my computer is being loud in the background. It's been on all day. Uh, let us avenge Lord Odin together. Maybe I can try and move my microphone a tiny little bit. But I just got to get through this. Yeah, because I was too excited to, to get into this chapter. Knowing what I knew. Sir Kinemon, today is the day that we that we bring change to one -O. Kinemon's rallying the troops. Prepare the cannon, says the Beast Pirates. There are so many. Who cares? They're in battleships and all they have... Are, oh, we're in battleships and all they have is ferries. Then we've got Kandro with Mamonosuke. Mamonosuke looks like a baby in his hands. Time to report. I've got... I've completed my role. There's only one thing to do now. And he's... Looks like he's painting. Karamatsu is jumping in the water. Have you contacted Onigashima? I'm trying, but they're probably so busy with the feast. They're not noticing. Oh, so Karamatsu's going in... Oh, he's going into Kanjiro! And Kanjiro's painting a crane on the floor. A very detailed crane. Like, uh, he's like Sai at the moment. He's actually doing some good drawings. Oh, and he's going in. They clash. Karamatsu versus Kanjiro. Karamatsu, says Kinemon. You shall not have Lord Momonosuke. Oh, but I will, Fishman. Kazuki is finished. And the crane comes out and it looks really realistic. Karamatsu, says Momonosuke. Lord Momonosuke! Says Karamatsu, and we see like feathers falling off the crane, and there's Kandro on the crane. A giant crane. Ah! Next, I will find Hiori and kill her. 
Oh, don't say that to Karamatsu. Now that I know she's alive, and Karamatsu looks angry, Kinemon is shouting, You, you knave! I see how smoothly that bird you've painted flies, but you never showed us anything but ugly monstrosities that washed away in water. <laughs> and then Can uh, Kandro says, Farewell, you fools. It's too high. I'm scared. Oh, that's Momonosuke because, you know, his fear of heights from... From when Kaido held him in his hands. Let me down. Either way, you will never triumph over Master Kaido's forces. Oh, he, is, he does call him Master, so he has some loyalty to Kaido. Not just Orochi. You'll never even set foot on that island. Ka ka ka! This is a really interesting turn for Kanjiro. Let He's gone from like one of the least interesting to one of the most. Let me back down, says Momonosuke. Is he going to go like your dragon form? I'm scared, someone help! Then Luffy, Kanjiro, Momo, where are you going? Oh, this, Luffy doesn't really realise. We've got all of the Yakuza bosses there. Ah! He's got Lord Momonosuke. Give our Lord back. Oh, we got Sanji. He's going up into the air. So I'm guessing that Kanjiro turned out to be the mole, Robin. That seems to be the case. We need to help. So Sanji's on his way up. Luffy, Kanjiro's an enemy spy. He's capturing Momo, says Chopper. What? Says Luffy, time to escape into the clouds. Really? This whole time? What a jerk! Oh, shoot him out the sky! Go on, Usopp. Everyone's going against Kanjiro. This is great. Oh, what's that? A thunder cloud, huh? What's that cloud? Turn back, Sir Sanji. I have a bad feeling about... What is going on? Ink... He's... So he can't just do it. He doesn't just make drawings through his paintbrush. He's making it through his hair. And there's... Ink coming out of his hair. He's like the guy from, um, he's like the guy, the CP guy. What, what was his name? Oh, I forget his name, but you know what I'm talking about. The guy who controlled his hair. Um, game with a K. Damn it. Oh, well, let's keep going. Uh, I'll throw a picture up of him. Uh, whatever he's doing, it's something we haven't seen before. Rain down ink arrows. So his powers are a lot more than what we saw. He's actually a really powerful guy. This is really cool. They're like, they're coming down, they're smashing up crates. Ah! Oh! You, Yukikyo, oh, Yukikyo portrait, evening shower. Hard port, and it's ripping up the ships. Kanjiro, man. Kanjiro. Stop this, Kanjiro. They're all going to die. Yes, says Momo. Yes, that's right. They're finally going to die. What is with you, Kanjiro? Your father Odin. And we see Sanji protecting Robin and Usopp's in the background like, Whoa, what about me? So Sanji came back down. Uh, not protecting uh, Robin. He's protecting Nami. Ooh, favoritism. Hope Frankie's protecting Robin. Uh, and Master Toki. Delayed their deaths by 20 years. Dangling pointless hope before them. But the general... But the general all have those brave and hardy samurai follow. But the general, all those brave and hardy samurai follow, is just a wailing child without conviction, cowering from heights. Kaka, what a joke. I know most of all that I am not Kazuki Odin, says Momonosuke. I know it better than anyone. Can you all hear me? Lord Momonosuke, so he's giving a speech. Do not fret about me. That is what the enemy wants you to do. Oh, he's stepping up as like a leader here. I will find their way to escape on my own. Destroy Kaido and Orochi and protect Wano. I don't know. I don't know how I can't do it. I don't know how I can't do it. No one will rescue me this way. But, oh, that's him thinking. Everyone's crying. Ah, the poor brave boy. Such... Such divine courage. Lord Momonosuke. And Luffy's smiling. By Momo's standards. He's being a real man. Hey, he's got he's got respect from Luffy there. Luffy's vouching for him. Luffy is putting his trust in him. That's right, Momo. For such a cowardly, dumb little brat, you're just a kid with a top knot who's all talk. <laughs> but for Luffy, that's big respect. Who is that? Cut him down, says loads of the people from Wano. Find a way to survive. We'll go... And rescue you. Because we're pals. Ah, oh, that's good. And then Momo's crying. Oh, so, like, I'll find a way to escape. So, Momo was trying to be 
once again, Luffy reminds Momo that it's not about status, it's not about who you are, you know, it, it doesn't matter if you're a king, if you're the, gonna be the, you know, the head of the Kazuki clan, if you're a friend, you're gonna help each other, that's great, that's great. We see uh, Nod, 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 so he's nodding, and we see Kanjiro going off, Nod, 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 so he's on his way to Onigashima. Uh, let's go to Onigashima, you got it, that's Luffy, telling his crew. One of the ships is escaping, says uh, Frankie. Uh, we're all be, they'll all be going the same direction, huh? Wasn't there another one? We already sank it. Who's saying that? That's that's who's that? Well, wasn't there another one? We already sank it. Oh, says Frankie. So ships are going down off in the background. Are you all well? Says Kinemon to the rest of the fleet. We have a few damaged ships and casualties. Let's hurry and land on the island. Nothing could be worse than to die at sea. Hey, and then Jiro's now on their ship with them. And Shinobu's there as well. I am sorry for this, Master Kin. I have fouled you. Ah, oh, so she wasn't the traitor. The important thing is that you're well. They will not take Lord Momonosuke's life. They will... Oh, because you're going to use him as a hostage. And then we got uh, Raizo saying to Denjiro, What happened to your face? <laughs> and then Denjiro just says, Plenty. Let's hurry. Come on, mate. you got to explain it. you got to explain a little bit more than that. What happened to your pompadour? Why'd you throw it away? <laughs> it's good to see you. <laughs> he says then. <laughs> then we got Law. Hey, this isn't your samurai garrison. <laughs> we appreciate your help. Oh, because they were all on Law's ship. They were a submarine. I'm not helping you get off. What? Why are you saying that, Law? You're part of the Alliance. <laughs> Don't say that. He's just trying to. He's just trying to act tough. Kid says, "Don't let the straw hats get the jump on us." Yes, sir. I love how they're all kind of bantering and in it for themselves. Ah, uh, ah, uh, what's that? Something blew up. It, it came from one of the fleeing ships. Huh? A long distance cannon. They were just measuring the distance from that far away. What is this? So is this one a Kaido ship? Ah! The weapons of Wano are high precision. Oh, look at these massive cannons that have been made. What? What is going on? A long distance cannon. They were just measuring the... Oh, did they accidentally blow up one of their own men? What what happened? And thanks to the weapons factories, we've got a whole array at our disposal. Ooh, looks like my quality is paying up a bit. Hopefully it doesn't go out of sync. Let's see you try and fly at us again, suckers. Pull back, more distance. Oh, so this is one of the Yakuza. It's like a sniper ship, does he? Or was that the Beast Pirates? I can't tell. Damn it, I thought it was fishy that they ran off. Oh, it is the Beast Pirate ships. They have like sniper, they have like sniper ships. Full speed ahead. Head, we gotta get closer, says Luffy. Sink all the samurai ships you want. See if like a kid just that he just wants to uh he just wants to take down Kaido. I don't think I don't think we saw Killer again, by the way, in that panel with Kid. Let's have a look. Uh I can't see I can't see Killer in the background. Okay, so that was a bit confusing, but it was uh, one of Kaido's ships was like a like a sniper ship. Okay, that's really cool. And then we see it blasting all of the ships. Then Jiro, if they manage to maintain this distance, we'll all be sunk. Okay, so they're just picking off all of one of those, all of uh, the Alliance's ships one at a time with his sniper powers. Come on, Usopp, Usopp, you can do it. Da ha ha, this battle's already over. We're untouchable back here. Huh? Spear wave! This would have been so much better if I weren't spoiled. Spear wave! And we see, coming out of the ocean, a great big spear out of the ocean. There's a huge hole in the ship. Our long distance cannons! And we got Brooke. Something's, ha something's happening over there. I'm so excited though. Maybe they're being killed by the vengeful spirit of the baby who died at sea. <laughs> this is Robin! <laughs> Oh, Robin, you always say the best things at the worst time. At this moment, that sounds cuddly. What's going on? At this point, that says Usopp. Robin, why would you think that? 
and we see the beast pirate ship got absolutely destroyed is someone out there well met good people and we see someone standing on the on the uh, sniper ship as it's being destroyed begging your pardon I know who that is uh, you turn the double page spread and you can see him on the other side but let's let's keep going as if we haven't I how <laughs> he's doing a big introduction I how from the Fishman Kingdom of the Ryugu Kingdom on the bottom of the sea. And we got Luffy. <laughs> Look at Luffy's face. Everyone's cheering. Zeus is even there as well and he's happy. I am a humble newcomer to this group, having imposed upon folks left and right despite receiving a ritual cup. Having imposed upon folks left and right despite receiving a ritual cup. From the boss of the Straw Hat crew, they call me Jimby. First son of the sea, and <laughs> Lord's like, are you kidding? For the sake of a long and fruitful relationship. How long has Jimmy been thinking up this speech? And we've got, we've got Kid. <laughs> He's surprised. He's joining the Straw Hats. And then Jimmy says, I would be pleased to make your acquaintance. There he is in one o. He's, he's wearing. It looks like one o gear almost. That he looks great. <laughs> Sorry for forcing you to wait like that, but I've come back alive just as I promised, Luffy. He, he doesn't look like he's got any damage. I thought he was going to have an eye patch or something. Straw Hat Crew, Helmsman, officially, Jimby, first son of the sea. What a, what a title. Straw Hat Crew, Helmsman, Jimby, first son of the sea. Bounty, 438 million berry bounties. I'm glad I made it in time for the battle. Luffy's like, Jimbe! And everyone else is like, Jimbe! Even Carrot! Boss! Next chapter hit April 12th. Don't have to wait. Is there anything else going on with Jimbe? We still don't know how we got... How did he get out unscathed? <sighs> what has happened to Jimbe? That's the end of the chapter. That was great. How did they get out of Big Mum? It's going to be interesting when they get to Onigashima and Big Mum is there. Maybe we'll find out the answers there. Uh, is there more to it? I really hope not. But Jimby is finally there. All of the straw hats are there. Plus Carrot, potential future straw hat and Zeus as well. <laughs> I love Law and I love Kid's reaction to this. Are you kidding me? He's joining the straw hats because he is a big well-known name. Definitely now going to be one of the strongest of the crew. Ho ho! A new monster trio is being formed. That was brilliant. That was fantastic. Even though I knew it was coming, I was still happy. Still happy to see Jimby is finally back in 1-0. All we need now is Neko Mamushi. Neko Mamushi and everyone would be there. And who's Neko Mamushi going to bring as well? That was great. It's going to be a review time very, very soon. Hey, so thanks for watching. What did you think? Let me know about it in the comments below. And if you enjoyed my video, maybe give it a like. And if you really liked it, why not subscribe? You can follow me on Twitter, Instagram and Twitch. Oh, and here's a related video you might enjoy and something more fresh. I've been Higassin and I'll talk to you next time. Bye!